Okay, today we're going to do the mean proportional. I'm just going to draw a square which has the exact same area as this rectangle, which is 50 centimeters squared. So I'm going to start by extending the base, just like so. And then I'm going to bisect that line, the base line, by just get my compass and put on one end point and coming out more than halfway, swinging an arc on both sides, and then coming from the other end point and just intersected the marks. And then it's going to straighten up them two points. Now that is the center point of the line. So now I'm going to, from the, that point, I'm just going to swing an arc going from one end point to the other. Like so. Now, and now I'm just going to draw our mean proportional line, which is just the end of the rectangle, and up to where it touches the arc. And now what I can do is, using my compass, I can get the length of that line and just drop it down to here and then extend out the line again and bring it up oh, here's the compass bring it up the same length just draw the line straight up straight across and then so there we have a square which is of the same area 50 centimeters squared and we can prove this through similar triangles so if I draw a line from the mean proportional down to the first base point and from the mean proportional down to the second base point again so here we have Two similar triangles because so we have a 90 degree angle here and another one here because this is a straight angle it's 180 degrees and up here we have another 90 degree angle because that is a triangle within a semicircle they always give 90 degrees so say if we name this angle at 30 degrees then because this angle is 90 degrees we have to get a 60 up here and because this is a 90 degree angle, this angle is going to be 30 and then again 60 down here. So there we have two similar triangles as we have two 30 degree angles, two 60 degree angles and two 90 degree angles. So it's angle, angle, angle. So they're all the same. And then because these are two similar triangles, this proves that the main proportional has given us a square and a rectangle of the same area.